Sonny James once again here with Serato on the West Coast. Serato DJ Pro is so fun to mix music with. Some of the features I like to utilize include looping, cue points, beat jump, effects, and now Serato stems. However, there is a feature I think could be talked about way more, and that feature is the record function. Sometimes you have those nights where you know everything was right in the club and the crowd was losing it the whole time. It's nice to have the ability to easily capture those moments in a bottle and revisit them later. So first off, the recording function works both with DJ hardware and without as long as you have Serato Play enabled. This is included in the Serato DJ Suite as well as the Serato Expansions Bundle. If you have Serato Play and want to do this using only your laptop, go to your setup menu and in the Expansion Packs tab, be sure the Serato Play box is checked. Then click the recording button here and a panel will open beneath the decks with some options. Since I have the Denon DJ Prime 4 controller here, I'll plug into it. Then when I click on the pull down menu here that says mix, I can assign which channel I'd like to record specifically. This is helpful if I want to exclude sound coming through other channels on the mixer. The recording options here will differ depending on your DJ hardware. If I have Serato video enabled, there is also an option to record the video mix. Since I know I'll just be recording an audio mix today, I'll keep it on the mix option that is selected by default. Next, I'll decide where I want to store the recording. The default location is in the folder named Recording, which is in your underscore Serato underscore folder. I'll keep that option for now. Next, I'll confirm my input volume is turned up, but not so high that it distorts my audio. A general rule of thumb is to stay in the green and yellow, but not go into the red on the meter here. Now, I'll begin recording by clicking the record button. While the recording is in progress, I can decide what to name the file and type it in here. I'll call this recording Illvibe NYC Dope Mix. Once I'm done recording, I'll click the record button once again and then the save button. As soon as the mix saves, it will automatically appear in a crate called recording to be referenced later. You can choose to save your recordings as 16 or 24-bit WAV or AIFF files by going to the DJ Preferences tab in Serato DJ Settings. If you're recording a mix and forget to save it, Serato DJ will save it to a recording temporary folder until you click record again. Beginning a new recording will automatically replace what was temporarily stored here, so always be sure to save your mix. Finally, please note that if you have tracks loaded from one of the integrated streaming platforms, recording will be disabled. And if you're already recording, then the ability to load a streaming track will also be disabled. Recording in Serato DJ Pro is super easy and comes in handy for content purposes, recording scratches on songs, or just to practice and play back things you may need to tighten up. Try it out for yourself and start to build your catalog of live mixes on the fly using the record function in Serato DJ Pro. For more information on this feature and all of our products, be sure to visit serato.com.